Hello, good morning. Welcome to my channel. Uh, today, I want to show us how we can calculate the mean and the standard deviation of a Lacasque like questionnaire. As you can see on your screen, I have a sample of a Lacasque like questionnaire where the mean has been calculated and the standard deviation. So but I will wipe this all out and do it again so that you can see how to calculate the mean and standard deviation of a like scale questionnaire. First and foremost, we have to know that a like scale questionnaire must be a scale, an incremental scale or a decremental scale. Um, the labels of the Lacan scale questionnaire that are all coded. So if you have a five point Lacan scale questionnaire, you have your code, your code for the label running from one to five. But in this case, we have a four point Lacan scale questionnaire. So in calculating the mean of this questionnaire, first let's calculate the total. The total of the questionnaire you just use on Excel, we use equal to sum. Then we we'll click on the cell, drag down cell, we want to calculate the total. And this gives us the total of the first statement in the Lacan scale questionnaire. So to save time, we just have to drag this down and it's applied. The formula is applied to all the cells to which we drag it down. Then in calculating the mean, we we'll do this equal to sum. Uh, it has to go this way. Sum. Yes. So this first one, this first option, SA, and the code, if you look down, the code for it is 4. So you multiply it by 4. Then the second option, agree. Agree, the code for agree is three, you multiply it by three. Then the fourth option, the third option, disagree, which code is two, so you multiply by two, multiply by two. And the last option, strongly disagree, and the code is one, you multiply it by one. You close the sum. So this will give us the sum, then we have to divide by the total, that is the, 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 the respondent, the total of partic the participants of, of this particular survey. And these will give us the mean of this, uh, that particular statement, like a statement. So we drag it down together, we have our means. Now, in calculating the standard deviation, we have to calculate for the second mean of the like a statement. And you calculated the, like, the second mean of the like statement. Instead of using 4, 3, 2, 1, we have to use the square of it, which will give us, which will give us 16, 9, 4, and 1. So we use this in calculating the second mean. This is the code we apply to calculate the second mean. So we do just that sum which is this multiplied by 16, agreed, multiplied by 9, disagreed, multiplied by 4, and strongly disagree, multiplied by 1. This will give us the sum for the coding, then we divide also by the total number of respondents. This gives us the second mean of the statement, the second level of mean. Uh, you know, when we differentiate, we differentiate first, differentiation, second, differentiation. So this gives us the second mean. Now, in getting the standard deviation, it's very easy. We we'll just have to uh, do this, find the difference of the first mean and the second mean. Then we'll square it. That is just what we need to do. Difference of the first mean and the second mean, they will square it. So in doing this, we just have to 
do this, which is SQRT, the difference of the first mean of the goods and this. So that gives us our standard deviation. We apply that. Now, note in mind that you only calculated this second mean because you want to calculate the standard deviation. It ends, you only you only calculate for the main. So if you are analyzing your like scale questionnaire using only main, there's no need for you to calculate the second main. And when you calculate use, analyzing using main and standard deviation, then you just have to calculate the second main, but there is no need to make it evident. It should be hidden. It should be hidden. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you find this interesting, please do like it and share. Subscribe to the channel. Thank you.